DIY Watercolor Flowers by Marie Boudin. The Beginner's Guide to Flower Painting for Journal Pages, Handmade, Stationery, and more. Uh, so you're getting three chapters, but you are getting a site variety in each, so yeah. So you're getting different exercises and like creating your own uh, palette. So like in chapter one, you're getting like the basic techniques like the equipment, paint, brushes, um, creating contrast and stuff. Part two, uh, chapter two is a uh, plant directory. So like roses, peonies, carnations, and a few others. And chapter three, floral, floral um, compositions, flower ball, carnation freeze, foliage frame. So that's where the projects come in. So. Like, you're getting like color chart. Uh, you're getting um, saturation, so like um, color strength respects the purity of a color. Um, like the amount of water in like each, and then like different palettes. So creating your own kind of thing so like which one would be in each and so you're getting like the flower here and then like step how to do like this is like the side view and then so like poppies kind of examples there and then step by step pretty much on how to paint it so like with the um, projects, you're getting like, like the name of it, the plants, the main colors. So the plants, the main colors, and then you get a, like a photograph of an example of what the author is using, and then how the author has done it and what the author has made it into. So that's basically. So, and like, the author's step-by-step -step on how to make it, and then kind of the end result of the project. So that's basic setup for each one on like how to make it, and you get like a good um, sense of like detail and like texture in it. Um, so like i think it's nice for people who want to do that sort of thing like to step up their like watercolor game it, i guess <laughs> it's give um she's giving examples of like what you could do rather than just like paint a nice little flower here and then go to the next thing so making different cards stationary type of thing so yeah i think um it's nice for who want to do that sort of thing and nicely well done. So yeah, DIY color flowers. Happy readings.